Well, this year marks the 29th year of Stamp Out Hunger. Tonight, Q2 Shaquille Cozart tells us how the Postal Service's role has changed and how you can help. The United States Postal Service is partnering with the Billings Family Service again this year for Stamp Out Hunger. And instead of delivering food, they're delivering checks. I met up with three mail carriers as they talk about why it's important that the community continues to donate for Stamp Out Hunger. The family service approached us, uh, actually we approached them that we want to do the envelopes because we didn't know if we were going to have another food drive this year because of the pandemic. And so they talked to me about the one day food drive that KTVQ is going to do and that we would coordinate our envelopes with that food drive also. Mail carriers will be delivering empty envelopes to all the residents on their routes starting June 8th. Residents will then be able to donate cash or checks that will be picked up and dropped off at family service. Pretty much go to every address anyway, so delivering the envelopes is a lot easier for us. There's a need for food and uh, extra resources for a lot of people in this community. You know, the U.S. Postal Service is involved in this because we've got probably the most amount of delivery units around and we could be able to spread that out uh, even further and be able to help out the community much better that way because of our number of our vehicles and the people that we work with. Reporting in Billings, I'm Shaquille Cozart with MTN News. Thanks, Shaq. Now on June 10th, Q2 will host a food drive with Family Service. If you'd like to donate, you can drop off non-perishable food items here at Q2 in downtown Billings, as well as local Master Lube locations. For more details, head to KTQ.com.